I painted and made a video roast of Asmon. Spent a lot of time on this and video in the comments. Okay, let's see it. A video where I roast and paint Asmon. Oh my god. Boys, alright, let's see this. Oh, it's the sword! Oh my god. Sup, y'all. It's me. It's your boy, Random Knees. And welcome back to Twitch Gets Painted, a series where I roast your favorite streamers for several minutes and then paint them for the last two. In the past, we oh painted my... Nick and Melina, Seer, Frozen, PVC, Nick and Melina, Seer. Dude, the Seer one looks really good. Holy shit, that looks really, really good. Wow. Frozen, PVC, and much more. They made, and on the they made his episode, nose even bigger than it had to be. Bronze League of Legends streamer who mm -hmm. goes by the name Amiru. Oh, on today's that. episode of Twitch Gets Painted, we are going to be painting a streamer mm -hmm. who goes by the name Asmund Bald. This was a heavily requested streamer. And I accepted the challenge What's because the little thing on my his head? lack of hair means I have fewer things to paint, which means less work. Asmon is from Old Baldy, Texas, and is a 56-year-old streamer who plays video games for at least 30 hours every day. Uh, Jerks that's... off whenever he doesn't stream, that's has true. a terrible diet, and has a very serious Wait, condition was that my... doesn't stream, has a terrible- Oh my god! That was all the stuff that I bought for the Legion release. Fucking Jello, Burger King. Oh, wow. Accurate? Yeah, it was, a, it was a good fucking times, man. Yeah, they were. People diet and has a very serious condition I have a great, great called head of hair. recidus hairlinus, which causes irreversible balding. Not to mention. His wait, eyebrows, wait, yo. Which causes irreversible. Oh my god. Oh my god. That's gonna look bad. Oh wow, that's gonna look bad. Holy shit. That's brutal. Balding. Not to mention, his eyebrows move up and down so much that they could generate enough electricity to power a small country. Some of the games that okay. this game plays mainly consists of MMORPGs, such as World of Warcraft, Lost Ark, uh -huh. Final Fantasy, and more. Yeah. All while hanging out with his best friend, McDonald. Asmond played World of Warcraft or WoW yep. growing up, but the guides he found online were so shit that he thought he could do better. So I did. he started making his own guides on the game, as he was arguably one of the top players in the world, uh -huh. being a rank one parser and uh, top 10 in world for mm -hmm. achievement points. Whatever that means. The real achievement here is how this guy managed- Okay, okay, all right, all right, all right. real quick, I wanna say, uh, the, the fact is that, number one, this is photoshopped, like, that hairline is 100% fucking larger. That's not, that, 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 that that's 100% photoshopped. Like, that's a fake picture. My forehead's not that fucking big. <laughs> number two, I forgot what number two was. To find a girlfriend at one point. But he's not only known for his takes on games. He will literally talk about anything and give his unfiltered opinions on said topics. Monday, I had something happen that I've had to have happen. Have to, you, you know, I, I fucking, I, you know, this is a. a, 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 a as his YouTube grew, it was obvious that streaming was the next step, and over the years, his channel has grown into one of the biggest channels on all of Twitch. Wow. Not to mention, he owns a sex cult disguise- Okay, look, I, I feel like this is probably one of the only pictures that we have that I don't look super bald. Because in, in a lot of them, I look like super bald. I think this looks pretty good. Yeah, I-, I yeah, I don't know how they did it. ...as a gaming organization called OTK. Poor Emeru, which stands come on! For one true kink. OTK has okay. pushed a lot of great content for the past few years, yeah. and continues to grow with their production value and content every year. That's true. It's really impressive. However, it genuinely surprises oh, me how far this man has gotten that. in life while being such a degenerate. 
At first, I thought this guy was British with how few teeth he has, but he's an American who survives on nothing but sugary soda drinks and garbage fast food. Look, number one, that was a really, really, really good cake. All right, it was a delicious cake. Amazing, all right? Yeah, it's just it so good. His room is filled with these Coke cups from the local gas station, something called yeah. Big Gulps, which happens to be the smallest and healthiest drink in America. That's true. A and W cream soda. And finally, I have those. Dr. Dr. Pepper. Peppers. Yep. Dr. Pepper. More like you're gonna need an actual doctor really soon if you don't drink some water. Okay. No, seriously, this guy has never drank water once in his life. Here's him consuming water for the very first time. If Asmund Bronze uh -huh. actually drank a full glass of water for once in his life, his entire body would make the Windows XP restart sound. But that was a good one. I I'm gonna be. Uh, that was, yeah. That was a. That was a fucking good one. Okay. Yeah. There you go. Water like in the toilet. Yeah. Sure. To be fair. I don't blame the guy for being such a degenerate because True. every time he wanted to do something productive, he got punished hard. Mm -hmm. He tried eating a salad for the first time in his life and he almost died from how gross he found it. As I was actually going to throw up like straight up. I I'm not even kidding. Like I was literally going to throw up eating that. It tasted so bad. I was so sick after that, it like almost ruined the stream. The reason why is like basically, oh yeah, it is the same shirt. How about that? That's crazy. Um, I, I just, there's something about certain textures and types of food that just makes me instantly nauseous. Like insta sick. Like there's no like, it, it, there's no way of getting around it. It's just insta sick. His life. And he almost died from how gross he found it. Yeah. Ass Mingle also did a stream where he showered for the very first time in mm -hmm. his life while wearing pants. And there was one frame where he dries his hair with a towel and. <sighs> and reveals his true. I don't know why I did that to myself. I, 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 I don't know why I did this. Like, I don't know how, like, nobody is like, it, it I just, I can't believe this. Hairline, which he's been there hiding from the world. A hundred percent of all the memes his community makes is about this picture. Who would have thought that <laughs> doing something which makes him a productive member of society yeah. would have been the biggest mistake he oh, those would have are the made. same pants I'm too. I know it, you know it. Everybody knows it. Everybody knows it. His community will yeah. roast me if I don't roast this picture. So I'll keep it quick. That's His true. hairline in this photo looks like a Pac-Man, Hadouken, a Nintendo 64 controller. A the thing, look at that. Pac-Man, Hadouken, a, a Nintendo. That's not really that much of a uh, of a distortion, is it? It's not at all. Yeah, it's that's totally fucking normal. Would anyways? Yeah, it's just crazy. I don't know how this happened to me. No 64 controller, a fucking anchor, okay. Vegeta. Uh, His hairline is sponsored by McDonald's. Okay. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. I'm balding it. It looks like the Tesla logo. You could play Friday Night Funk with that hair. Oh you can my upvote things on Reddit with it. It's a wait. We don't have that on Reddit, do we? Like, this isn't... This isn't on Reddit, right? Uh, yet. That's a great idea. No, I, guys, uh, come on. Cowboy hat. He could come star on. in The Last Bald Bender. And finally, okay. it looks like a fish hook. OTK even made his hairline into a hat. Which, Wh by the way, people actually bought some of these. It didn't sell super well. But there were legitimately people that went and they fucking sold, they bought these. It's a collector's item. It's generous. Yeah, I know. And, and like, so we, we do a big, like a, uh, like a competition where people can vote on like which one they want to see and, you know, like all that stuff. And so I, they do this and, um, 
this one wins by a mile. Nothing was even remotely close. Which honestly just looks like a giant fuzzy dick. But that's perfect because almond gold is also known to be a furry and a weeb. This is not like, listen, all right. I, th this is, this is a picture I took with Kriparian. This has nothing, dude, I look like a fucking fiend. Oh my God, I look like a fiend. Holy shit. So now that we know a little bit about this 90 year old balding, molding, uh -huh. closeted furry who only eats artificially produced toxic waste, Let's get into painting. I usually start off all my paintings by trying to find good reference photos. However, yeah. with a goblin like Almond, who only stays inside to play games, staring at pixelated boobs for 14 hours a day, it's gonna be hard to find high- Well, that's a little bit more than 14, but yeah, somewhere around there. Quality photos of the man. But I found one image where someone must have tricked him into leaving his dungeon to do a photo shoot for OTK. That's exactly what happened. I, I want to let you know that is literally exactly what happened. Is that like I had to go and do a photo shoot and I didn't want to do it. And they're like, you have to do it. And I'm like, I don't want to do it. They're like, you got to do it. And I'm like, all right, I'll do it. And so I got there like three minutes before they closed. I took like five pictures and that was it. No, the, it's, it's a nice fo photo and works well for what I need. I started off by making a really basic sketch of the man okay. and also putting down some colors. I wasn't sure on how to do the lighting since the reference photo doesn't have any dramatic lighting, which is usually good for paintings. Yeah. Luckily, I found this image of some dude which has great lighting, and I will be applying it to my painting. The dude even looks like ass mole! Next thing is thinking about the colors I should use for the piece. I have no idea what colors this guy enjoys, but I learned Purple. that in WoW, there's something called a transmogrification, which is just another word for pussy repellent. But basically- That's not true, that's the opposite. That's the only thing that girls do in the game. That's not true. Like, any time that Blizzard ever goes like, oh, it's Mog Monday, post your transmogs, it's just a bunch of girls with, like, their hunters that are dressed up. That's what it is. Every time. They're like, oh, she looks so cute. I love Sylvanas. I'm crazy, too. <laughs> That's what it was. It allows you to customize your character. So Little Baldy hosts transmog competitions, which are fashion contests for people who have no fashion sense. And it seems like whenever someone has purple on their costume, one. it automatically wins. That's, so all right. That's not true. Like, I don't know where this came from. It's like this fucking idea that like, I only let purple ones win. This is not, like, I, I never did this. Like, uh, all I'm saying is there were a number of very good purple transmog sets. That's literally all I'm trying to say. It's not complicated. It's not hard. Because not purple equals win, no, it doesn't. I decided that this piece is going to be predominantly purple. It's funny that a man who doesn't have any sense... This was in 2012 or something like that. And my dad bought me that axe for, uh, for Christmas. He legitimately bought me a fucking axe for Christmas and I went out and I was throwing it. Yeah. It's for fashion is the host for a fashion contest. He can literally be seen wearing the same shirt today that he wore 40 years ago. So I- My dad has pants that he wore in the 70s. Okay, like, I, this is not something that, that like, uh, this is normal, okay? This is totally fucking normal. Uh, 40 years? Yeah, that's all. He decided to write same on his shirt uh -huh. to show that this is literally the same shirt. Oh, There's a sword called Mogudar, the blade of a thousand dungeon resets, and it has a 0.4 chance of being dropped from an enemy. Except for if you're iron bald. In which case, you can take that point four and add a few more zeros to it. Man. Isn't that crazy? I've been farming that for two years. I still haven't gotten it. 
Like, I, that's really, it actually is pretty crazy that that's happened. Whenever you think about that, yeah, he's not holding back. It's nuts. Because this man has been trying to get the sword since it came out, and he still hasn't yeah. gotten it. To give you some context, this sword came out in 2012. Or, that's yeah, 10 fucking years ago. <laughs> His hairline has a higher chance of restoring itself than him actually getting that sword. He's also- No, I'll get it. Like, I, I will get it. Like, no, 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 that's not true. Like, I, I will get it. Like, it's gonna happen. Now, it hasn't, hasn't happened yet. No, it hasn't happened yet. But it's gonna happen soon, I'm pretty sure. Next time for sure? Yeah, absolutely. Mentioned that he doesn't like small swords. No. I don't know why but it's probably because he needs to overcompensate. So, I added the sword and made sure that because it was they're more nice useful. And Anyways, he will get the sword one day. I believe. I will. It's just that when that day comes, he will look like this. Now, I realize so that tomorrow. his chat is going to look at this painting and say, too much hair. So I turned this painting into a character creation screen, just like in the game's what? ass mold plays. I present to you, build a wow streamer. Oh my fucking. We have a ton of customizability. Cla Grease, tendrils, rat. Oh my fucking god. I, I just. Wow, that looks really, really bad. Holy shit. Cat's tail that's been dragged over his head. I tried hiding how bad my hairline is by going. Yeah, there are a lot of guys that do this. Bald, but still somehow failed. We got the creepy uncle. Okay, that's not. Listen, like, that is not what I'm gonna look like, okay? Like, this is. Th 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 that is. <laughs> I have to admit, I think that any guy that has this haircut is automatically an alpha because like this is the most fucking like middle-aged dad haircut that you can possibly have and everybody knows it so like if you have the uh if you have the self confidence to to rock this i feel like you've got to have like massive like you've got to have a huge dick uncle baldman gold and of course yeah. the classic ass mount gold's real hair mm -hmm. hope you enjoyed the new futures for build a wow streamer the last part of the painting is just polishing everything and there it is dude this painting comes in five different variations one by i bet it fucking does razor yes it is it is a razor chair um but we're not talking about that not until i get sponsored what uh, I'm going to wait till that. We'll, we'll see what happens. Okay, guys? How about that? There it is. NFT? Yeah, sure. My hair looks actually good, though. Exposed. I, I mean, I, I would have said it. It's whatever. In, it's not an NFT, guys. One, 16 by 9, Asmin Bald, okay. World of Warcraft loading screen, uh, and lastly, it also comes in the form of an animation. Links to these are in the Google Drive link in the description below, and the animation is available on Wallpaper Engine if you happen to use that. Oh. I also hang out on Twitch, so if you like what I do, drop by and say hello. Oh my I god. I make these videos and paintings whenever I feel like it. So if that's something that? that interests you, make sure to subscribe. Leave that a like was, if this you was hated really the good. video. Leave a dislike if you love the video. Please comment who I should paint next. Thank you so much for watching till the end. I love you guys. And I'll see you guys again very, very soon. Peace. That was really fucking good. Like, I'm going to be honest. Like, I think this was a really good fucking video, man. Like, this guy had, like, a, a, it's crazy. He's only got 2,000 subscribers. I'm really surprised by this. I think it's just, it was so well put together. Like, the, the comedic timing was pretty good. Like, this was really good. Holy fuck, man. Like, yeah, I, I, I'm legitimately impressed. Like, yeah, if he's here. Yeah, well, if you see this, man, like, this was really, really good. It was clever. It was funny. Like, yeah, it was fucking awesome, man. Nice job. Like, holy fuck. Yeah, comment. Yeah, I, I give him a, a sub now. Check his subscribers now. He's at 2.8. What's this here? 
Is it 3.6? All right, guys. That's what we like to see. I'll link it again. Yeah, make sure to give him a sub, etc. Right? Holy fuck, this was good. I am impressed. I am so impressed. This quality, yeah. This is a quality fucking video, man. YouTube algorithm. Yeah, it helps a lot whenever people like and give a lot of subs to stuff like that. It is. It's fucking great. Thank you so much for the fuck. Yeah, of course, man. It's fucking good. Oh my god, this is really well put together. Wow. Thank you so much. I... I can't believe that, like, that this happened. ...is his hair with a towel and reveals his true hairline, which he's been... And, and, and that was the thing, right? It's like, I didn't even know that I did this. And I remember whenever I was, like, drying my hair off, I intentionally tried to not do this. And it just didn't matter. Like, people just, they just went with it. They ran with it. I could never, like, I can never get away from this now. This is my life. And it's a fire? Yeah, it looks like a fucking fire, too. That's the problem, okay? Uh, like bulb handy. No, at guys, I'm, I'm gonna be able to... Listen, I'll get the hair transplant consultation soon. It'll be okay. Uh, I'm doing a painting series called Twitch Gets Panda, Paint Ferret Streamers. It was a video, Roasted Paint Asthma. Yeah, it was really fucking good, man. Sorry video on E-Rob a while back. Glad to see you here as well. Fantastic portrait, fantastic roast. You're a long time viewer, really did your research well. Yeah, that's fucking great. Uh, um, I cannot endorse such vile harassment. Yeah, true. Use it for your starting soon screen. Maybe I will.